Let's add within 20 by making a group of 10. Example number one. Use two of the tens frame. You will be using the red counters and the yellow counters for this strategy. Let's begin with adding 8 plus 7. On the first tens frame, place 8 of the counters. On the second tens frame, place 7 red counters. As you can see in the first tens frame, there are two spaces that are missing to make this a 10. We have eight yellow counters. Two more would have made it a 10. Let's look at the seven. The seven is nothing but a five and a two. Let's break the seven as five plus two. Let's drag these two red counters to the space over here. We have regrouped the numbers differently. Now you have 8 plus 2 on the first tens frame and 5 more on the second tens frame. The 8 yellow counters and the 2 red counters total up to a 10. And you have the 5 red counters on the second tens frame. Now it's easy to add. 10 plus 5, the answer is 15. Let's look at example number 2. In this case, we are going to add 7 plus 5. In the first tens frame, use 7 of the yellow counters to set them up. In the second tens frame, use the red counters to set up 5. As you can see, in the first tens frame, you have 3 spaces blank. Had you had those counters in there, that would have made a 10. Since we are missing it, let's look to see what we can do. Let's rewrite the 5 as 2 plus 3. If we move the 3 of the red counters into the space, that will make a solid 10. Let's go ahead and do that. 1, 2, 3. Now you can see the first tens frame is completely filled, which makes it a 10. 7 plus 3 is nothing but a 10. 10 plus 2 is 12. Let's look at example number 3. Once again, in this case, use 2 of the tens frame. Let's look at the example 6 plus 9. As usual, in the first tens frame, place 6 of the yellow counters. In the second tens frame, place 9 of the red counters. In the second frame, you can see you have one slot missing. Had you had a counter over here, that would make a solid 10. This is the one that is missing to make a 10. So let's look at the 6 differently as 5 plus 1. If I move this one yellow counter over here, this now becomes a solid 10. Let's go ahead and do that. Now, as you can see, the number now changed to 5 plus 9 plus 1. So you have a 5 in the first tens frame and 10 on the second tens frame, which totals up to 15. Let's look at a last example. Once again, in this case, use 2 tens frame. We are going to add 5 plus 9. Set up 5 counters on the first tens frame. and set up 9 counters on the second tens frame. As usual, you can see, for the second tens frame to make a 10, we are missing one counter over here. So let's go back and revisit this frame and look at it differently. 5 is nothing but 4 plus 1. If I move this one yellow counter to this space, this now becomes a 10. Let's do it. As you can see, now the second tens frame is a 9 plus 1, which is a 10. And we have 4 in the first tens frame. 
4 plus 10 is nothing but 14.